In this video, I am going to teach you how to make my Pug Polymer Clay Charm. I use a, like a beige off-white color, a dark brown, and black. First thing is we need to start with the body. I just pinch off a little bit of clay Using my wax paper on a hard surface, I just push down with my finger and I want to make a shape that is a bit more oval than it is circular. If I compare it to this, this is pretty close. Next I want to make the muzzle and I'm going to use the black Way. I'm going to pinch off just a little bit and then I pinch this into the shape of a triangle, a flattened triangle. And then I'm going to take a razor blade and I'm just going to cut the bottom of it off. Be very careful with your blades. This one's really dull so you see here on the charm, the snout muzzle is just a little less than half of the length from the center of the um, base of the head. So I want to be sure to place this in the right spot. And that looks to be about right. Next is I want to put the brown cane around the snout, so the way I'm going to lay this on, I'm going to drape it. Over the top, like so. Looks like he's got a little foamy on too. And we're gonna trim it. And trim this side. Next, I want to draw with a pin the eye holes. The next step, what I want to do before I lay the other pieces in, is I want to do a dusting of chalk color to make some definition on his cute little face. Okay, so these are the colors that I want to use. I want to use this dark brown and this lighter dark brown. So I like to use my razor blade to score the chalks. You know what, I might use a little bit of black too. Okay, next, I'm going to put the eyes in and the eyebrows. I need the eyeballs first, so it's easiest just to take the black, make a cane. And then cut with your blade two equal lengths and roll them into balls to make the eyes. Now, go back. we're going to go back to these um, other brown kings that I have, and we're going to make little eyebrows. Okay. 
Okay, now it's time to put the, see these folds in the face? I'm gonna draw all of those with this tool. Okay, now for the nose. As you can see here in the detail, I have a little nose and um, little dots to have the illusion that there's whiskers, and then that cute little pouty pug face. Need a lot of clay for these, I just pinch off a little bit. Next step is we need to put an eye pin in. Next, all we need to do is clear coat him and then add some little white details to the eyes so that way it looks like it's reflecting. These are the clear coats that I use. I This is a, made by Liquitex. I actually use these for my acrylic paintings and it works great for polymer clay too. This is the Liquitex gloss varnish and then I also have a medium uh, matte finish. So I'm gonna use this on the entire body of face of the pug and then I'm gonna use this for the highlights. Next step, I'm going to add a tiny, tiny little white dot to the eyeball, and I'm going to use some of this uh, Liquitex Heavy Body Titanium White Paint. And there it is, finished. Please, if you like this video, feel free to rate it, thumbs up. And if you have a question or a comment, please do so in the form below. Thanks so much and have a great day.